Here we're asked to find the effective annual rate corresponding to a rate of 8% compounded quarterly. Now although we've actually solved problems like this without ever writing down a formula, just sort of figuring it out, I suspect that most of you are going to want to just use the formula. So that's what I'll do here. I'm going to use R sub E for effective annual rate. Sometimes I call it EAR for effective annual rate, but in any case, whatever you call it, to calculate the effective annual rate, you take the quantity 1 plus R over M, raise it to the M power, and subtract 1, where these uh, letters stand for what they usually do. In particular, R is the annual interest rate. M is the number of compounding periods per year. As usual. So for this particular problem, the effective annual rate would be 1 plus 0 0.08 because the um, R is 8% and as a decimal that would be 0 0.08 and M is 4 because it's quarterly so M would be equal to 4. So that's raised to the power of M and then subtract 1. Simplifying then we get the effective annual rate is now 0.08 divided by 4 is 0.02 and when you add 1 you'll get 1.02 that quantity is raised to the fourth power minus 1. Now I don't suspect anybody's going to have any trouble doing this on the calculator, but since I have mine here, I'll just do it. I'm using this Casio FX280, uh, two, excuse me, 260. And basically all you do is type in the base, which is 1.02. You hit the power button, which is the X to the Y button. And then you do 4, because the power is 4. And you press equal. And when you've done all that, you can see that the effective annual rate is 1.082432161. minus 1. Okay? Which, of course, is... 0.08243216. Now, of course, on this problem, I really didn't ask you to leave it in a particular way, but it was given to you as a percent. The regular rate was 8% compounded quarterly, so you're probably going to change it back to a percent. And I also didn't tell you how to round it, but let's just assume that we were asked to round it, write it as a percent, and round it to the nearest hundredth. And if that were indeed the way we were asked to leave the answer, the answer would be 8.24%. So 8.24% is the effective annual rate uh, corresponding to a rate of 8% compounded quarterly.